Hi y'all. Today is Saturday, February 7th. It's like uh, 5.45 in the morning. I'm just getting off work. Y'all, can you believe today is the 7th? Well, by the time you watch this, who knows what day it'll be. Maybe the 14th or something by the time you watch this. But can you believe how fast time is going by? I mean, did time really go by this fast when we were kids? I don't think so. Y'all, it's Saturday, February 7th, and it's about 3 p.m., and we're at our church. See the lovely cross back there? We're at our church, and uh, we're meeting with a couple that um, they're, they fellowship with us a few times, and they're looking for a new church home, and they wanted to meet with us because it's funny. They've seen me. I was the first one they saw. Uh, they came to visit our church, and this is when Charles was um, really sick. Remember, he was in the hospital, and I spoke. I gave the sermon that Sunday, and they just happened to come. Someone invited them. One of our other members invited them, and that was their first time and their first impression of our church. And they were saying how they really enjoyed the message that I gave, and they said, if with me giving that message, it just made them think they can't wait to see the pastor and hear from the pastor so they came back and they heard my husband speak but I wasn't here because I was working at the races so I didn't attend church that Sunday and so they haven't seen us together and so this is the first time they're gonna meet with us together so we're looking forward to meeting with them so um, I'll get back with you all later so our meeting went really well at church we met about an hour with the couple and we just really enjoyed the fellowship and when we were done talking they said that um they want to you know fellowship at our church join our church um, what y'all know about that old school michael there that's what my husband been doing working day and night OMG, y'all, my day is not done yet. Now we're at Winn-Dixie. But well, I'm good and full, because we just left BJ's, which is a restaurant, a bar and grill. So, there's Stubby right there. So, now we're in Winn-Dixie, getting some stuff for the, the um, program we're having at church tomorrow, because we're having a multicultural event at church tomorrow and we're eating so a long day y'all and I think I might have slept an hour since getting home from work 6 30 this morning that's all right this is what we do y'all hey, we're just leaving when Dixie well we ain't leaving yet y'all see my husband over there he talks to every body OMG does anyone have a spouse like that or are you the one that That's talks Monday to Monday morning February 9th can you believe it's the 9th day of February it blows my mind anyway I'm here at work and um, it's about 5 30 a.m. almost time for me to be done with work I'm done at 5 45 and I'm off Monday and Tuesday the rest of the day on Monday, Tuesday, come back Wednesday night. So I'm looking forward to my next two days off doing absolutely nothing, but probably playing around on YouTube, reading my word, getting with Jesus, <laughs> and just resting. Hi, y'all. This is so, so blessed. Welcome to the blessed place. How y'all doing? Welcome to a long-awaited, much overdue, first time for 2015, Walk With Me. Auntie Deidre walked all the way over here in the rain for you. Oh, can I get a smile? Can I get a smile? <laughs> can I get a smile for that? Thank you. Thank you. That made it all worthwhile. That made it all worthwhile. It's Tuesday night, uh, February 10th. I'm in the kitchen. Uh, but I'm just frying up a little wing, a little specialty wing. And I got some in the oven and some I'm frying. Cause my husband likes to fry it. and we'll have some french fries with it. So, just checking in. There go my wings. Some still fine. 
I found them in the oven. Y'all, my barber said that he was gonna get a dozen roses and pass one out to each woman, each woman for Valentine's. Ladies, if y'all get one rose for Valentine or two roses, not the whole dozen, y'all know where the rest of them going, right? To the other women. Don't don't go for it. Don't go for the okie doke. Get more categories so you can get more roses. <laughs> What is gonna be in one category? <laughs> you gonna get what What is it? What is the category? How do you get? How do you get into more categories? You take the wife. Oh, okay. So don't just be wifey. Be wife. Well, no, you gotta take the wife for sure. Uh, you gotta read that. It's a packet. Uh, okay. You gotta learn, you know, the customs and. I don't know what he's talking about, y'all. Man, if she's single, then obviously she ain't going to get the thing when she's married. Oh, okay. Yeah, so she got to take the whole package, leave the room short. Learn what a wife said. Then her flowers will increase. Her garden will grow. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Her garden will grow. See this on one seed. Yeah. Better leave that man. Yeah. I don't know what, what page this might be on. I can't say too much. Yeah. She want a garden. She got to plant more seeds. <laughs> Worried about this one seed he putting in her. Yeah. She got to plant the seed up on it. Family structure, plant the seed up on Hygiene, plant the seed up on and you see the spiritual, where you see the family, a lot of things, instead of just that bedroom. I know that's right, instead of a mouthful of them. So they get one room. If y'all can decipher that code. Yeah. <laughs> they better even see this. <laughs> oh, I'm sharing this with all the women so they can learn. Well, plant the session. So they can learn and grow. They better like they gar they can grow like that garden. They better send their ears back and listen up. That's right. Hi y'all, this is so so blessed. Welcome to the blessed place. How y'all doing? I'm so excited. I get to do a video tag.